What's up YouTube? It's Coach Corey and today we got some sneak peeks on what's going to be in the next Brawl Stars update. So let's get into it. Alright guys, so Supercell just gave us a status report on what they're working on. They put it on Reddit, I'll put a link in the description if you guys want to see exactly what they said. But here's what they said they're working on to try and get either in the next update, sometime earlier, or sometime after. We're not exactly sure. The first one they said is they're working on an auto-aim nerf. Thank the Lord, that's definitely the biggest problem in the game right now. And I've said this earlier too, that they're working on this, but it's good that they're just reiterating it. And hopefully that gets in a good amount before the update. Hopefully that, that gets in as soon as possible, but I'm sure they're trying to take their time with it and make sure they're doing it right. They don't want to have to make multiple changes or multiple different nerfs, I'm sure. Another thing they said is they're trying to improve the tutorial. I think I've talked about this in other videos too. That was definitely something that I think has been a little lacking. It would be great if you could play multiple brawlers, multiple different game modes. I feel like Brawl Stars is a pretty complex game. There's a lot of different things you can do. There's a lot of strategy. It's totally different depending on the game mode. So it would definitely be good to have a better tutorial. Another thing they said they're working on is to make it easier to brawl with your friends. So that's kind of exciting. I think social features is definitely a big deal in the success of any game. So I don't know exactly what that means, whether it's like easier to invite people, maybe it's you can friend people, or maybe you can invite people from profile. I don't really know what it is, something like that. Who knows? There's definitely multiple different ways you could go with it. Another thing they said, which I'm really glad about this, is they're making, they're trying to make trophy pushing more rewarding, more worth your time, which I'm gonna be honest, end game content has been really lacking in Brawl Stars basically since it's come out. There hasn't really been any big reason to push trophies besides like you want higher trophies. So that's definitely great. I'm glad they're focusing on this. I know they've been thinking about it for a while, so I'm sure they have a lot of ideas. I'm really interested to see what they're gonna add to the game to make it more rewarding. Okay, this one is really exciting. They're working on a new brawler, and they sounded a little confident about that one when you compare this to the next thing. So that's really exciting. New brawler, let's talk about what we think the new brawler could be in a moment. But the next thing they said is they're working on a new game mode as well, which that's really hype. I wasn't really expecting a new game mode, I'm gonna be honest. New brawler, I was kind of, kind of expecting that. We didn't really have any new content in the last update, so I think they really want to get some new content in this next update just to sort of make up for that a little bit doesn't really make up for it but just to sort of get new stuff in the game so they said this one though they said it's more of a maybe they're not quite sure if they're going to finish it in time so we're not sure if the new game mode will be in the next update or not but hopefully it is at the least we know if it's not this next update it's the one after that, I'm being honest guys, there's already a lot of game modes, seven different game modes if you count the ticketed events. So that's definitely awesome. They're continuing to expand the game. Brawl Stars is honestly already so diverse. I feel like there's really no game like it. So they're getting even further with it. That's awesome. So that's really exciting. Now they didn't say this in the post, but they did say this in the last Brawl Talk. They said they were like, I don't remember the exact percentage or what exactly Ryan said, but it was... He said they're about 90% sure or something like that, that spectating will be in the next update. So that's another thing that's going to be in the next update, my guess as well. I don't know if replays will be, but at least spectating is awesome. That makes the game so much more enjoyable. I feel like you can watch your clan your friends, whatever. And of course, it allows esports to happen, which takes a lot of time to get off the ground. So it's good to get that as soon as possible. That way... Half a year, a year down the road, we can maybe have a legitimate esports scene in Brawl Stars. Auto aim nerf pending, of course. So guys, those are all the things they leaked to us. I'm sure there's probably some other small things as well. And maybe there's some things they're not quite confident that they'll finish that they don't want to say yet, but could be in the next update. Who really knows? So let's play some games and let's talk about what they said to us, because I'm really excited about all this. What are you guys most excited about of that list? Is it the auto aim nerf? Is it the new brawler? Or maybe the new game mode? Or maybe even, you know, playing with friends or trophy pushing stuff? I'm going to guess it's probably not going to be the improved tutorial though. What map is this? Temple Catacombs. Okay, who do I want to push up? I kind of want to push up El Primo, but I just feel like he's not that great. Let's just go Ricochet. He's pretty good here. 
Okay, so one thing I wanted to talk about was what do we think the new brawler could be? Because they said this before, you know, one of the ways they decide what brawler they're doing, what new brawler they want to add to the game is they look at what brawlers are missing. Why are you guys both going that way? Oh, this ricochet is being really aggressive. Okay. I don't know what happened to the ricochet. I guess he got away. But they okay, so here's my guess for what it's not going to be at the least. It's not going to be a close range brawler or a shotgun brawler. There's like three shotgun brawlers already. Daryl was one of the most recent brawlers. Or the most recent brawler. Excuse me. So I don't think it's going to be close range. My guess, what I feel like is maybe lacking from the game a little bit brawler wise, is maybe it's, oh, say live bull. Maybe it's um, a support type brawler. I think that would be really cool. Sort of like a support mid range or something like that. Oh, man. Oh, yes, again, the spike. And the ricochet is down now, too. Oh, I got to make sure I don't get hit twice. And I got hit twice. I think it's going to be some sort of support brawl. What would be really cool? Oh, stay alive. Oh, oh, yes. Get wrecked. <laughs> oh, team wipe. Let's go. Oh, yes. I think it's going to be some sort of support brawl. What would be really, really cool is... If it's some sort of brawler that like increases the damage of your teammates, that's something I've been wanting for. Something that would also be really cool, but I don't think they're gonna do, just because it could cause problems. Is a brawler that has some sort of either star power or like super ability that allows him to place extra walls on the map. That would be really cool. That would be game changing, for sure. All right, what did I get? I want to upgrade my piper. So piper points, please. Nope, those are not piper. Um, you know what? Let's just get my first win bonus in all these places. Why not? And I'll stick with Ricochet, too. So I think maybe a support brawler. It could be a long range, but I sort of feel like, you know, Colt, Brock, Ricochet. There's a lot of long-ish range brawlers. And the thing, too, with the support brawlers, I feel like a lot of them are, like, really game mode specific. So I feel like if you are adding support brawlers... It's not, like, a huge impact to the game. Like, if you had a long-range brawler, it can, like, potentially play in a lot of different game modes. Oh. Uh. Oh, he's dead. You should have stayed by the wall, man. Oh, what? No, Piper. Oh. Oh. Save me, teammates. Yes, no spikes hit me. That was uh, not that great. I'm not going to lie. I sort of just panicked there. Okay. But I feel like support brawlers a lot of times are more, like, more games. Like Tara. Well, I guess it depends on if they're like mid-range or not. Like mid-range support. Oh, my joystick was off the screen. That's something that needs to change. Oh, those spike hits. This spike is... Auto-aim. He's just running in there. Oh, no. If Oh, they're so low. Wow, that's game-breaking for us. There we go. One kill at least. Now we got to get that dynamite. That's our biggest thing. How the f does this dynamite have so many kills? Who is dying to the dynamite? Oh. Uh, Crow, play the game. Crow, play the game. Man, Moltis talked about in his recent video, what should a penalty be for people who are AFK? Definitely some sort of penalty would be good. Man, their spike had six stars. Guys, why are you, why are you hiding in the grass like this? What are you doing? Oh, but the crow got him. Yes, yes, yes. We're up by one. Wow, let's go. Please don't be aggressive. Please don't be aggressive. Don't get sniped by the Piper. Okay, we're up now. Okay, that was a good barrier. Good good buffer. Even if both those guys die, we're okay. Nice, 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 nice. But what about the new game mode? What do you think that could be? I'm not really... Do you think it'll be something that's in the main rotation? Or is it going to be like a ticketed event? 
Now, guys, I actually have no info on what all these things are right now. Now, if I did, I wouldn't be able to tell you probably, but I actually don't know anything about all the new stuff. I wish I knew about the auto aim nerf, really. That's what I want to know most. Okay, heist, bandit stash. I guess I'll just go Colt. No, let's try Dynamite. Let's see how frustrating this is. That's something I need to improve too. A Loki thing I need to improve is making throwers easier to use. I'm not really sure. That's one thing that is definitely something that needs to be improved in Brawl Stars right now. But I'm not really sure how to make throwers like that much better. What is our... Okay, our comp's pretty good. We got a good defensive composition here. There we go. I don't get, like, what What was that crow going for? I don't think he realized what he should be doing. Did that primo go back to his base? Fried chicken. Yes, he did. What is the primo doing? He really just healed up. Interesting. Did it pretty far back. Hmm. I think this is going to be a W. Oh man, I cannot hit my shots. There we go, there's a little bit of damage. Nice, Ricochet doing work. Fried chicken, no chance. They really don't have any damage. Their damage is like crow. Not damage. Nice, nice. And then I wonder how they're going to make trophy push more rewarding. Like, are they going to do leagues? That's probably a good guess as to what the trophy pushing reward could be. Something like leagues, like they have in Clash Royale, maybe where at the end of the season you just get like a better reward. Could be something like that. I mean, they already have, like, you know, you reach certain trophy levels, you get, you know, like 200 coins, 200 keys. I'm still not used to the word keys. Okay, nice. Oh, it's just me now. Hmm. Got him. Nice. Here we go. I'm ready for you. Yeah, getting knocked. Let's go. Mm, tutorial, I don't know how to prove it, but we definitely already talked about that. I'm not that exciting. Auto aim nerf, I hope it's a damage nerf. Like a 30% damage nerf or something very strong. They were very clear in the wording. They wanted to make it not dominant for auto aim. Which is definitely good. I'm not sure what else. Okay, there we go. So yeah, guys, let me know what are you most excited for out of all these sneak peeks that they talked about could be coming, or they're working on, and should be coming, hopefully, in the next update. So let me know. Is it the new Brawl or the new game mode? Maybe even, it's just the auto aim nerf. Hopefully that's before the next update, though. And hopefully that's really soon. I have no idea what they're planning. But alright guys, that's going to be it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I will catch you later.